I've already installed the Wine Start menu here, so I'm not going to go through the setup process, but I'll let you know that these two shortcuts have been added to the desktop. The first one is going to be the Start button. We're going to double click that and launch it. And there you go, there's your Start button. And what this does is, it shows you or gives you your Windows environment within Wine. So you got menus, submenus, and you still have your Linux environment right below it, so they're both accessible when you need them. The other advantage is you'll get an app store here, so you'll be able to install anything for Wine that you may need. So in this case, I already installed MyPal, which is a web browser compatible with Windows XP, so you would just highlight that, right-click, install. It's already installed, so I'm not going to do it here. But it was just to show you that the menu works quite well. We'll launch the task manager. I will also launch regedit and notepad just to show you that everything is working as it should. Also I'm going to launch Explorer. And there you go, those are apps. So we're just going to close these. And then we're going to show you what that second icon does. Before we go to this second icon, this one here, we're just going to right-click on this one to unlock it, and then we have the choice of either closing it with the X or moving it with the bar. So in this case, I'm just going to relock it, unlock it by right-clicking and Xing out. So this is the Wine Start menu button, and what it does is pretty much the same thing, but it places it in a different location. It puts it right here in the assist tray. So if you were to click on that, you get the same menu. Um, and your Linux menu is still there, but the Windows menu is right here and out of the way. So you get the choice of using either the Start button or the menu. So the choice is yours, but they both work well with Wine, uh, especially with Wine 6.01. And that's it. There you go. There's your Wine Start menu button in high resolution.